policemen and women are family members. They are somebody's father, somebody's mother, somebody's daughter, somebody's son, somebody's husband, or somebody's wife. It's not good to generalize everything. And at times in every society, you cannot miss one or two bad people. In a community where people believe are murderers, you cannot miss one or two who are innocent. I'm saying this because in most cases and in most places in the world, the media only focuses where the police do wrong. They rarely focus where the police do right. If a police kills one individual, human rights activists will organize demonstrations against the police. But if an individual kills a policeman or a policewoman or injures a policeman, human rights activists don't do anything in most places, or they rarely do. Not because these police are not human beings, but because they believe it's not their duty. For example, if a police officer is provoked, somebody throws stones or somebody tries to shoot at them, then they run away. And all this time what is happening, the media is there. And when they run away, when the police try to follow such people and they go and break the houses to get these people, most of the time the media will show where the police break the houses and arrest such people or shoot these people. They never show that the same same people started provoking the police. The police should also, if possible, should also have their own media. During demonstrations, demonstrations is people's right. Whenever you're going for demonstrations, it is good to have knowledge why your demonstration. It's good to have understanding how demonstrations are done. But it's better and the best to have wisdom on how you are doing it, when to do it, and when to stop demonstrations. There's what you call the regulation force in military. When police put regulation force, demonstrators should also put the regulation force. When demonstrators do the demonstrations peacefully, the police should react in a different way. When there are goons in, demonstra in demonstrations, it's easy to know if there is no chaos. But remember, there is a, in, a, in a certain country, when opposition was doing demonstrations, the opposition had their own snipers. And the snipers will shoot their own demonstrators. Later, they blame the police. We can never meet such characters. So it is true, at times, police don't know who are shooting, and at times, they know. It's good to give them benefit of doubt. But for today, I'm saying that policemen and women are somebody's family members. The police should respect the civilians, and the civilians should respect the police. Everybody should know where to draw the line. Because any action has a reaction. The media should not show the reaction only. They should also show the action. They should also show where everything started.